Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to record your computer screen uh, with Filmora 11. Alright, so Filmora is a very interesting video editing software because uh, it does let you edit your video, add uh, interesting things to your video and it also has a screen recorder. Uh, we let you record your computer screen, your webcam, audio from your microphone and system cells, stuff like that. It is very helpful for content creators who want to, uh, to create educational video like me and other teachers and students and stuff like that. Alright, so let's go to my computer screen so, so that I can show you step by step on how to, uh, to start the recording and how to set up your recording and also how to adjust the webcam and stuff like that. Okay, let's go. Alright, so now I'm on my computer and this is a start page of Filmora 11 and actually you can access to the screen recorder right, right here at the start page so you can click here at this button to start the you know, screen recorder inside Filmora it's easy, right? Uh, just wait a, a moment Alright, so this is Wondershare screen recorder so as you can see on the screen uh, we have a webcam here and we have a toolbar menu right here and uh, this is a webcam, uh, this is my uh, my laptop webcam, so the quality of the video is not very good. But if you use a webcam like my Canon 800D, the quality of the video will be much better. Okay, so I'm going to show you step by step on how to set up your screen recording. Uh, this is the toolbar, uh, for example, we can move the webcam to here uh, on top. And the first thing, you want to select the screen recording area. Okay, on the left side of the toolbar, uh, here you can select this menu to select a custom area if you want and you can also adjust the size of the recording area. For example, I can click here uh, at the custom area and then I'm going to move this one uh, right here. Uh, you can click the center at the center of the area to move this uh, recording area and added to that you can also handle the size uh, of the recording area uh, with this button, okay? So move your mouse to the corner of the of the rectangular to uh, to resize it, and also you can uh, click here uh, to resize it. Also, uh, it is very easy, right? Uh, so this is a second option, and the next option, if you want to record a, a Windows or a open web page or stuff like that, you can select this uh, option, uh, target window. By the way, normally I will select full screen because uh, when I do uh, tutorial like this, I just uh, record full screen and then I can uh, zoom in and zoom out uh, inside when editing. Okay, so the best option for you is to go full screen. Uh, just click here, full screen. Okay, so that is for the recording area and the next option you want to select is the, your system cell. If you want to record the system cell, uh, the audio inside your computer, you can turn on this option. Okay, and you have also some option here to select the speaker or the output of your computer. Uh, but for this example, I'm going to mute it because uh, maybe uh, there will be some noise in my computer and it is annoying. Okay, and the next thing you want to select the microphone you want to record. For example, you can click here at this menu and I have a USB microphone, this one, so I'm going to use it. Um, but maybe if you have a headphone, a pair of headphones or in your headphones stuff like that, you can also use it to record your voiceover. By the way, the quality of this uh, microphone will be much, um, yeah, uh, much lower, lower than the USB microphone that I'm currently using. Okay, and next up, you want to customize your webcam and your mouse cursor effect and also some uh, click sound effect. You want to click here at this menu. Uh, this is a setting menu. Okay, so when you click here, uh, you have a drop down menu where you can select a location for you to save your screen recording. And you can change it by clicking this uh, folder. Okay, so for example, I can click this folder and can create a new folder. Uh, for example, recording example for example then uh, i'm going to select this uh, folder okay and select folder and now uh, when i start my screen recording it will save to this folder uh, recording example and down here you have the option to select the frame rate for your screen recording you can click this menu and then you can select the frame rate that you want to uh, to record uh, it is up to 60 frames per second if you're recording a gameplay or stuff like that you can select 60 frames but for a normal tutorial video, I always select 30 frames per second. And here's the video quality. If you want to get the best video quality possible, you can select best, um, best here 
but if you want to reduce the size of the screen recording, you can select better or good or stuff like that. Okay, uh, for me, I always select best. And down here, you have some option to re uh, set up your record timer. But but I never use this uh, option because for me, I don't think it's necessary to uh, set up a recording time because whenever I want to stop the screen recording, I just stop it. Okay, but uh, you can uh, check this box and then you can set up the hour, minutes and second for your screen recording. Uh, five minutes or ten minutes or stuff like that. Uh, after that, it will stop. Okay, so I'm going to uh, disable this one. And here you have some option for your mouse click. Uh, for example, I can change it to uh, this yellow one. And if you want to hear the sound, the click sound, you can enable this option. Okay, and down here some shortcut. Uh, shortcut for your uh, screen recording you can play the screen recording or pause the screen recording or stop it uh, with a shortcut F10 and F9 and finally you have the webcam option uh, so you have the menu also and you can select integrated webcam with this one uh, this is uh, my integrated webcam on my laptop and you can also select an external uh, webcam this is uh, my Canon 800D by the way I'm currently using it for my screen recording so I'm not going to use it I'm going to use this one for example so we can select the integrated webcam and now we can start the screen recording with this button okay so I'm going to click on that Alright, so this is the screen recording and you can see uh, whenever I do anything on the screen, uh, the program will record my computer screen. And being mentioned that the webcam here, you can also resize and reposition the webcam. Uh, if you, it covers something, you can just uh, move it to here and if you think it is too small, you can make it bigger, uh, smaller. Okay, and move it to the corner, maybe here, because uh, it will be side by side to my uh, my Camtasia webcam, and it will be here and here, uh, so you can compare the quality of the viewing webcam with the external webcam. Okay, so that's easy, right? And whenever you want to uh, stop your screen recording, you can just find the uh, screen recorder here at the notification area. Okay, so you can click here and then uh, click this button, open the recorder okay so i'm going to uh, move my webcam and this is the recorder and you can see it is the time it is one minute and you can pause the screen recording here also and you can click this button to stop when you click this button to stop the screen recording it will open filmora for you to edit your video okay so i'm going to uh, stop it and make my webcam a little bit lower okay and now you need to close the screen recorder and here's your screen recording, uh, or here's my screen recording, I'm sorry. And it is creating proxy, by the way, I'm going to cancel the proxy. And now if you want to find this screen recording, you can just right click and select review in Explorer in the folder that I have just created. Okay, let me stop it first. And this is a folder, so this is my screen recording. You can right click and see the property of the screen recording. Okay, so this is the detail of the screen recording. It is in 1080p and the frame rate uh, 29.78 frame. Okay, and let's click OK. And now you want to edit this screen recording. All you need to do is to bring it to the timeline. Keep the project setting. And here's the screen recording. You can listen to the audio and also see the screen. Okay, it's very easy. Just play it. All right, so this is the screen recording, and you can see uh, whenever I do anything on the screen, uh, the program will record my computer screen. And being mentioned that the webcam here, you can also resize and reposition the webcam. Very nice, right? So I'm going to export this screen recording, and I will put it at the end of the tutorial so that you can see, uh, you can see the quality of the screen recording and also the audio. Okay, so that's easy, right? So that is how to start the screen recorder uh, at the start page. Uh, by the way, if you are here, you can also start the screen recorder. Uh, just go to the media and then select the record button right here. And then you can select the uh, record PC screen. And this is the second way to start the screen recorder. And by the way, you have another way. Just go to file menu right here. And then you have an option, record media. So you can start uh, recording your screen right here uh, with a record screen button. All right, so that is how to record your computer screen. 
with Filmora 11 on my Windows 10 computer. By the way, you can do the same in Windows 11 also. I hope this tutorial is helpful for you. If you have any more questions, just let me know in the comment section below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye. Yeah. All right, so this is the screen recording and you can see uh, whenever I do anything on the screen, uh, the program will record my computer screen. And being mentioned that the webcam here, you can also resize and reposition the webcam. Uh, if you, it covers something, you can just uh, move it to here. And if you think it is too small, you can make it bigger, uh, smaller. Okay, and move it to the corner, maybe here, because uh, it will be side by side to my uh, my Camtasia webcam. And it will be here and here, uh, so you can compare the quality of the viewing webcam with the external webcam. Okay, so that's easy, right? And whenever you want to uh, stop your screen recording, you can just find the uh, screen recorder here at the notification area. Okay, so you can click here and then uh, click this button, open the recorder. Okay, so I'm going to uh, move my webcam and this is the recorder and you can see it is a time. It is one minute and you can pause the screen recording here also and you can click this button to stop. When you click this button to stop the, uh, the screen recording, it will, uh, will be in your, your Filmora. Uh, when you click this button, uh, you will be... When you click this button to stop the screen recording, it will open Filmora for you to edit your video, okay? So I'm going to 